You know the first thing that Zach Banner said when he saw me? What did you say? There you go. Right there? Yeah. Right, right there? Okay, yeah. cool. What did you say there to me? There we go. What did I say to you? When you walked up to me. I saw, oh, today. Yeah. I said you've been putting on some weight. You said oh. no. You said I've been putting on some 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 girth. Yeah, some girth. Some girth. Some yeah, heat. that sounded he horrible. He ate a bag of You're chips for dinner the other night. It's no. not muscle. He's not oh, getting when, when an athlete sees another athlete, and he got a tan. You look good, bro. So y- here you are. <laughs> you get crushed by Alabama. Yeah. And you're probably thinking season's mm-hmm. over. I mean, how ugly. Uh, that's not what I was thinking. What were you I'm thinking? Not, I was thinking we were all thinking when we left that game that that's just not. That's not our team. That, that, that wasn't the way we needed to play. Um, you look at the score, you would think, like, okay, these guys, they're, they're all hype. SC's hype again. You know, it's not going to be a good finish. Just, you know, Chad, our All-American left tackle, finished the season at All-American left tackle this year. Uh, on the opposite side of me, he had, he had some injuries. He was out. Um, we needed to figure out the quarterback situation. We had some other injuries in some other places. Uh, some you can question the play calling and some of the things that like I'm not questioning Coach Helton's coaching, but I'm co- I'm questioning if we knew who our identity was as a team. You didn't have one. We didn't have one. Okay, so then you finally put in Sam Darnold. Oh, there we go. How awesome is he? So let's talk about Sam Darnold. Let's who, talk about who, how who? round his face is. Why? Can we what? just talk about that? Like just how round his chin is, just as a natural, like an incredible. You, you've Does seen he have a quarterback right? face? He has he has the court. You've never seen. It? I mean, he has the quarterback face. What? He has the little round. You know he listens to the show. I know he does, and he's sitting right now, and he's hating me. But this is all. This we, is just. I want to see a picture of for his all face. the glory that he's gotten this year. I'm here to crush him. But no. Can anyways. I can I say this? What makes him different? The versatility. I, I think it's the ability to see somebody who's such a great pocket passer who can get the ball off, who knows when to get it off, who takes who takes risk but can also run and can control the ball and can control the game. And when in college football, when the spread option and things like that, when other teams are doing that and we run a pro-style offense, we're able to add that ver- little bit of a versatility to run some QB zone. And He's got kind of a blue-collar thing, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. He's, he's, he's really just – a dude. He's all about football. That, that he's not a he's not flashy, and that's how he is off the field too. He's a really cool dude. He was a linebacker first. Was he? You know, he was what, a linebacker in high school. That's I what I, I was told. That. He was a linebacker. I don't got, know if he's I don't know if he's hard enough to be a oh, linebacker. Come on. We're giving him too much credit. All right, he is pretty. You know, I heard a scout tell me yesterday. Texted me, said I think I'd take Darnold number one if he was available. By the way, I had a scout ask me about Zach Banner. You know what he said? What he say? he said he's a good-looking, smart kid. Does he love football? Yeah, I, I do. I, he says, I love his size. I love his intelligence. Mm-hmm. I love his personality. Does He goes, that kid's going to be successful in a bunch of stuff. Does right. he love football? I, I love football. I love everything that comes with it. I like, you know, obviously being on the shows like this and everything. that. But that doesn't come if you don't play at a high level. And I understand that. And and um, I'm, I, I just want to work. I want to be the best. You know, I became the best in college. And that was earned. It wasn't given. It was earned. And uh with that being said, I'm, I'm excited for the next level, and I'm training my butt off every day. So you're probably going to be a first, second-round pick. I don't know. Does it matter to you? Sometimes if you go to a second second round, you go to a better team. It matters. It matters. There's, there's, there, I don't care about what team I get drafted to. You don't? I, I, I just I don't have any preference. Um, Cleveland? I, just, I, I would love to play in Cleveland. All 32 teams, all, and I'm not just saying that on camera, all 32 teams, it's a blessing to get played to play football. Aww. Uh, this is the bottom line. I mean, I, I I get to work out every day and look at myself in the mirror and and wor- work on <laughs> work on offensive line technique. Are you kidding me? Like like you know, some people have to sit in a cubicle. Sorry if there's people here who have to do that, but I, that's just that's just. Do you not know me. the first time you and I met? Yes, back in you, my freshman year when you, you were walked onto campus and I took you that? over to that. How do I remember that? So I I'm walk not on, that old. Like, I walked on I, campus. You still have your like, memory intact? Yeah, right. Like I've been, been, I don't have CTE or anything you walk- like that. <laughs> How do I remember that? <laughs> no, you walked on campus. Lane Kiffin was a coach, right. and you're like, uh, Mr. Coward, I like your show. Yeah. I want to be a broadcaster. And I said, well, all right, maybe, uh, you know, whatever. And then I went along my merry way, mm-hmm. and then I come, and I followed you, and I saw you at practice several times. Then right. I saw you in studio one day, and I'm right. like, you're interning? Yeah, I've been interning at Fox Sports for the past three years, and I think I'm the first intern to be a guest on the show. Wait wow. a minute. Setting records out here. I'm what serious. did you do? What was your internship? I was over here, like, every day, like, watching Right over here. Yeah. I yes. Know, I know that you have that, like, that little blanket right there to cover your Wait a minute. You've been right over there this whole time, and I'm, I didn't I'm know? I'm the biggest man in college football, and you didn't know <laughs> that. I do have a bl- <laughs> Whatever. That- 
You're a very good water. intern, like sneaky. But you know, he's, by the I way. I do have a blanket. So when you intern, is our intern program just a lark? Do you do anything? I, okay, I was working. I wasn't just like, what did you do? Like, what did you do? Because we didn't well, know you were here. I came in, so I would come in and watch a show in the morning yeah. and do, do what we're doing right now. And I'd stand over there and I'd watch and I'd kind of just take notes on how you guys do things and I realize how easy your jobs no are. Kidding. Tell me the and notes. So tell then, me the notes you took not on Colin. Only that, huh? What the, notes the notes you just talk just talk and 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 think that your ideas are the best thing in the world. <laughs> That's basically <laughs> what I took from Colin. And so and you have to have a huge ego when you come no into this kidding. business. Oh, and then there also no egos so I, and then I worked uh, worked upstairs for the for the baseball department and everything making beat. Those guys are smart up there. They're very smart. Making b They are a lot smarter than the people on camera. I'll no tell you that kidding. Right now. I will heads. tell you that right like now. Brad, Sorry. you know Brad upstairs? Yes, I do uh, know he's Brad one of the upstairs. smartest guys. Don't tell him that. But <laughs> so uh, Zach Banner is going to be a first uh, round pick, I imagine, out of USC. I want to go back to the Rose Bowl. And I said this before. That was, I, you know, in the moment you over dramatize. It may have been the best football game collegiately I've ever watched. When you're playing in a game of that magnitude, Zach, do you have a sense? Like, are you having fun or is it all work? It's, it's all fun. And the reason why is because going into the game, you know, I have so many good guys around me, Coach Callaway, Coach Goff, Coach Helton, all these guys in the office that are telling me it's your last game, but just go have fun. And so going into the game, I was just thinking to myself, like, no matter what happens, make it fun. And so during the game, obviously, it's not fun losing. And we were down a little bit going into the to the fourth quarter and everything. And I didn't feel nervous, but I didn't feel confident. It was just kind of that middle ground of just saying, let's finish. Let's finish the career. Let's get it done. And we did. It was the, it was the best feeling in the world, winning that game. God, it was a great game. Let's go back to Darnold, who obviously now is one of those kind of and – and I'm a big fan of college kids staying in college longer. Uh, you could have come out. My, my theory is Cam Newton came out after one year. I covered a guy named Akili Smith. I think it's hurt Cam. He was never refined. And then some of his mistakes mm -hmm. in the pros haven't been coached up. I like – Andrew Luck staying another year. Okay. I want a college quarterback to have 35 starts. Right. Because, like Deshaun Watson right. at Clemson. De right. Deshaun's been against Bama right. twice. I think more starts. Yeah. Is Sam the kind of guy that he'll, he'll, he is so talented, right. and because it's at USC, right. he could probably leave early. Do you right. think he likes college? I think he's, he loves college, and, and he's a hard worker. And I think Sam's the type of guy that knows himself. He's not, he's not, he's very humble. He's not too cocky. He'll know when the right time is for him um, to, to go to the next level. And I and, and the next level will be there, whether it's next year, the year after, yeah. or the year after that. We got to remember he was a redshirt freshman this year, which is incredible. incredible. R incredible. And so with that being said, whatever Sam decides to do is going to be the best decision for Sam. And, and, and that's, that's the best thing. Okay, so would, if I, let's just, let me just say a team. Uh, Arizona. Cardinals. Well, I know that, but would you like to play for Arizona? I, would, I just told you I would I like know, to play for. I know, but you for, say Are you that. listening to me? I, I am listening, listening but you're just saying stuff. Now. Is anybody listening to me? I would like to play for all 32 teams. Okay, please. But but Seattle could really use a left tackle. And I'm born and raised in Tacoma, Washington. Oh my god! How awesome is so that? So that one's your Where'd favorite. Where'd you go to high school? Stadium High School. Lakes. I did not go to Stadium. It's a very nice school. You guys ever seen? Uh, um, what was it 10 Things I Hate About You? Was yeah. That, that was filmed in. Stadium High School. That oh, little, that's a fun yeah. fact. Yeah, a little fun fact. Lakes yeah. High School is for the rich kids. Lakes High School is not for the rich oh, kids. Oh, it is. You're, are you kidding me? You want, didn't you go to Seattle Prep? <laughs> sure. Wow. I did Last not. year, Busted. you've been bougie since you were a little <laughs> oh kid. <my> are <laughs> you kidding me? Bougie. Heard. Don't ever try to attack me, Colin. No, Please, I went to don't. a very small don't. rural school and made my own uh, lunches. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. What were they made of? Lemon olive uh, oil yeah, cake? Yeah. Peanut brittle and wood chips. I grew <laughs> yeah, up very right. poor. Okay, so uh, I got I got nothing here. I got nothing left. Uh, let's see. Uh, advice. I'm just looking at the screen. I look really good. Okay. Oh. Like really good. See, I'm already getting that ego. About Where did you find that sweater? Um, Fox Hills Mall. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Kind of. Well, urban. you had Kiffin, Sark, right. Ed, and Clay Helton. How's mm -hmm. Clay different? Clay is the man. And I don't even go there anymore, so I don't even have to hype him up or talk about him anymore. You know what I mean? He he not only cares about you on and off the field, he cares about your well-being. If you're not doing the right things in school, he's going to sit you down and tell you what they need to do. If you're not doing the right things off the field, taking care of your body, he's going to tell you. And if you're doing the right things, he's going to give you a 
a, a, a smack on the butt and say good job and which that that's probably the best part about coaches if they can find that balance and he's able to find that balance faith family football that's his thing and if it's not one of those three things he doesn't he doesn't care about it so I mean he's he's an amazing person amazing man I love him to death and I wish he was here four years ago it would have if if this if he was here four years ago we would have been a couple national championships deep right very now. solid man I really very mean that. stable man I really mean that okay all right it's good seeing you why don't Thanks, you go man. get a big workout in and get drafted Appreciate by that. the Seahawks or Arizona I, that's yeah. where I'd like to see you land okay because I could watch you play and I know the people that are big shots I don't want to nothing again Cleveland's wonderful yeah Terrific. Yeah. Buffalo. I heard they have the great food. There was another intern here from Cleveland the other day. I Shout need out to, to hear Fanta. more about this intern We fired him. Like, what did you go home and tell I'm not friend? talking to you because you are rude because I literally used to sit right there. And you didn't say hi to him. You never said you hi didn't to me. either. I, I, we actually talked a lot. A lot. Okay, it's, we got to go to a commercial break. Bad. You guys work it out. Zach Banner, ladies bad. and gentlemen.